Similarly, we have agreed in principle on a framework for possible U.S. withdrawal as part of a package deal. We have a similar uh, engagement with the Afghan government. Our hope is, our expectation is that once inter-Afghan dialogue begins, which is our key objective, that these uh, parallel discussions will be brought together. But even if we achieve success on these two issues, uh, we make further progress, a peace agreement would not be uh, immediately or shortly or achieved in the foreseeable future without a comprehensive agreement on other issues. And as I've said publicly in my tweets before, nothing is agreed to until everything has been agreed to. And the other issues that must be dealt with are issues of a roadmap for Afghanistan's political future to end the Afghan war, Afghan, Afghan war, uh, the Afghans must sit across the table with each other and come to an agreement about their future of their country. All sides tell me that I have talked to that they have learned lessons from the past, that previous governments that, whether it was a Taliban government or others that dominated Afghanistan and imposed its unique vision by force on others have been a failure. So the time has come, they say, for an inclusive dialogue leading to an inclusive peace.